Okay, so once again, here's the service bolt for the centrist. And so basically, what happens is, this is the part inside the transmission. And this part here, this is a replacement part. It's a bigger orifice for the part of the transmission. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to plug, uh, I'm going to put uh, the seafoam trans tune-up in. What happens was it wouldn't shift into fourth gear. Okay, so they've got this stuff here. This stuff stops, slips, fixes, leaks, extends life. It doesn't say anything about shifting. And then we've also, this is pretty liquidy. Could be some sort of solvent. This one here, it's Lucas. It's a little bit thicker. It's This is a little bit thicker, like 30, 40 weight. Extends life. Prevents slipping, prevents leaks, wear in automatic transmission. Doesn't say anything about shifting. Here's the CTV bars. It's kind of liquidy. Stops belt slipping. Oh, this is for CVT, constant velocity transmission. It's a different kind than I got. This is the newer style transmission, CVT. And so here's the stuff that I got. It definitely says something about shifting on there. So it's the only one that th said anything about shifting. Um, here's a shutter fix. Instant shutter fix. Shutter, eliminator, and rough shifting corrector. Lube guard. Never heard of them. This is 11 bucks. Shutter fix. Type F. 1986 and earlier. It's too old. There's one that says Lube Guard Protectant. Fixes shift problems, reduces slipping. It's only 16 bucks. I think I'm gonna get this just for the heck of it. Package. No oh, slipping. No more slippage. Wax, liquid wax, esters, restores, additive content, worn out transmission fluids. Provides smoother shifts for optimal performance. Technology reduces, rejuvenates seals and O-rings. Fixes shipping, sh shifting problems. And that's what they got. So this is this stuff here, and uh, of course uh, nothing's going to fix a bad transmission, but rather than replace the transmission, I'm going to give this a try. So I'm going to drain a quart out or something, this is uh, 16 ounces, I'm going to drain about 16 ounces out and then I'll pour this in and check the fluid. You check your fluid um, with the uh, car warm, put it in 
drive and reverse a couple times and then put it in park and leave it running. If you have bubbles on your uh, dipstick for your transmission, it means that your transmission filter could be plugged up. Um, check the, if you have bubbles, check it once after you've driven it. If the bubbles go away, then you don't have a problem. So this one here, basically it says right up front, cleans harmful fluid residues that cause rough system operation and erratic shifting. So theoretically this could work. This, basically this is, um, you can put it in and leave it in, or you can put it in and flush it. Yeah, so that's what this is. Now uh, what I'm going to do is I'm just going to put it in and uh, I may flush it after a month or so. But I'm just going to put it in, leave it in, and let it run. Okay, that's the stuff. You can see I put it, I got a hard drive magnet on here. I was putting magnets. It's a good idea to put a magnet on your oil filter as well. And I got about a quart out. You can see this fluid doesn't look too bad. Um, it does look a little bit worn. I've actually flushed the pan twice. This uh, nut bolt here with this pan. This is the uh, second time I flushed it. And it comes out fairly clear, but you can see there's, it seems like metallic particles inside there. Um, so that's kind of what it looks like. And uh, this stuff actually works good for, you know, in place of WD-40. So I wouldn't throw this stuff away. I'd use it for lube and other parts, put it in an oil can or a spray bottle and use that for other purposes. Okay, let's give this stuff a try and see if it works. Cross your fingers. Okay, so I've basically driven it around the block. Probably not going to notice any difference at all. Uh, so here's the start off here. You can hear the shift. Wides out pretty good right there first. Second. Usually, when I first got it, it would shift into fourth gear right about here. It's not shifting. We don't know if it's going to shift or not. Um, time will tell. That's all we can do. Be patient. See if it works.